I'm curious how many of you watching this today, uh, I wonder if there's any of you, maybe just one or two perhaps, how many of you have ever made a mistake? <laughs> how many of you have ever done something and, and the moment you did it, the moment you said it, you immediately thought, oh, I, said, I should not have done that. Oh, I really wish I hadn't said that. Or perhaps you went through an entire season of, what? Why did I do that? Why did I go down that path for so long and make so many bad decisions? And you finally come to the realization, if I would just, if I would just make better decisions, I would have fewer regrets. Well, if you've ever felt that way, you're not alone. In fact, let's read a scripture that hopefully will be of encouragement to you. This comes from Psalm 32, the first verse, tells us this. Oh, what joy for those who have never made a mistake in their entire life. They've lived a perfect life, error-free. Do you really think that's what it says? No, let me, let's try it again. Here's what it actually says. Oh, what joy for those whose disobedience is forgiven, whose sin is put out of sight. Yes, what joy for those whose record the Lord has cleared of guilt, whose lives are lived in complete honesty. So again, if you've ever made a mistake, if you've ever had a season of mistake making, there is joy to be had in simply confessing and moving forward with your life. Don't let your past mistakes hold you back. Your future can be the best part of your life. Be encouraged. Father, we thank you that in spite of our mistakes, you continue to love and care and support us. You want nothing more than, than for us to learn from our mistakes and keep marching boldly forward. And so we promise to do just that with your strength. Thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks for watching.